and we're working to get answers to questions you may have about the COVID vaccine. And we're talking about booster shots once again today. You may have heard a lot recently about mixing and matching when it comes to boosters. So here's the question. Why is it OK to mix and match boosters? Here's what UAB's Dr. Michael Sag had to say on that very topic based on recently released data. I could argue that it's preferable scientifically to mix and match the Pfizer and the Moderna because they're they're stimulating the immune system with a little bit different part of the coronavirus. And so theoretically, you could say, well, you got the original part with, say, Moderna, you come back with Pfizer, get a little bit different part of the virus, and that could give you the best opportunity for a broad response that your immune system is ready to fight with. There's a lot of information to tackle when it comes to boosters, and we've got it all for you right now on the WVTM 13 app. A guide to who's eligible for a booster shot. Also more from Dr. Sag on which vaccine booster you should consider if you got the single dose J and J. Also, keep the questions coming. We're taking them to the experts. Let me know something you want to know. WVTM 13 at WVTM.com is the best way to reach me.